Hey, it's David again. This time, I'm going to use VTS to build a simple robot that watches a hand-drawn trend line and sends an email with an attachment of a screenshot if the trend line is broken. I'll use the function FN is trend line broken. This function is found under the trend line menu. I'll set the name parameter to upper. This is very important. This expert advisor will look for a trend line named upper and check if the line has been broken. Next I'll choose the direction to check for. In this case I choose from below because I plan on drawing the trend line above the candles and I want to know if the trend line is broken from below. Now I'll drag and drop a logical element and two end elements. One to come off the true output of the logic, the other for the false. Next I'll configure the logic. We check if the function fn is trend line broken is true. It will be true if the trend line has ever been broken. When the robot runs on each tick, the income and price is checked to see if it broke the trend line. If it has, the execution follows the true output of the logic element. So on this element, I'll go to the message tab, enable messages, and then check the send email and attach screenshot checkboxes. I save and close, click the build button to build the EA, and we are done. Going over to the price chart, I'll draw a trend line above the candles. I think this looks good. Now I'll edit the trend line on the empty platform and set the name to upper. Again, this is very important. It's the connection between the expert advisor and the trend line on this chart. Now I attach the EA and my trend line watcher is running. Let's go over to my Gmail account. This is what it looks like when the trend line has been broken and the email is sent with the attachment. Also, I have a screenshot of my iPhone getting a notification. It's amazing what this simple, single-purpose EA can do. And you could run as many of these as you need. Trendline watchers on different currencies and time frames, all watching charts closely, so you don't have to. The best part of this type of mini-robot is that it leads you naturally to further automation. Once you get comfortable with using this robot for alerts and emails, you'll have more confidence to take the next step closer to full automation where perhaps instead of just receiving emails or alerts, you actually open a trade instead.